Hi everybody, I'm Jack and this is Raw Tropical Living. Thanks for joining me today. Coming to you from outside again. I'm actually in the, on the playground in the little park in my complex. This could actually be some pretty good stuff for maybe doing some uh, workouts down the road. I was laying in bed last night and I'm going to move around a little bit. You guys said you wanted me outside so this may be a little shaky but we shack, sacrifice shaky for a little bit of uh, a little bit of a view. So I'm laying in bed last night and I'm thinking, you know, I think of, I think about things at night. Like I try to have be a little contemplative. I just, you know, let my mind go. That's right after I get into bed before I put a YouTube video to try to start going to sleep for the night. Well, last night I was, and you know, many of these nights I'm just kind of thinking like, um, you you hear specific comments people make or you, you, or you see specific ways that people are struggling and you just, I, you know, I really go over every inch of my brain and think like, okay, how can, um, how can you make this person understand this particular thing or this particular concept? And some of them just may be, it may not be possible. It may be something you have to experience for yourself. Just like the title of this, have you had the aha moment yet? Well, the aha moment, and maybe, I don't know that there's anything in life you can do to make the aha moment happen. The aha moment just happens. Um, like for me, and like I like to say this a lot of times, the reason I'm always just tearing my brain apart trying to think of a, you know, any sort of a tip or a solution is because this is so easy for me. And it's not, I'm not saying that like in some sort of a bragging way. You're talking, you're looking at somebody that has gone to the gym his whole life, you're talking somebody that has dieted, gone off dieted, somebody that's drank a lot, that's going, that's quit drinking. I've gone through a lot of ups and downs. I've gained and lost weight. It never was super easy. You know, it was always like a program and something you had to really get going. Um, from day one, this has just been the most simple thing I've ever seen. And I guess it's just because I happened to be in the right place at the right time and my consciousness was ready for it. Um, hey, I'm a little bit older than some of the people out there, so hey, there's no, there's never any judgment because I didn't come to this uh, lifestyle until I was what 48 years old. So I, I don't know what would have, I don't know what would have been like if I'd have, um, you know, if I'd have been doing this at 31 or 43 or 27 or whatever. At 48, I guess my consciousness was just ready to accept it, and it made sense to me, and it just clicked. And like I say, I mean, never, no, I mean, and not perfect, lots and tons of mistakes all along the way, especially in the beginning, um, biggest not eating enough, but it was never really, there was never any sort of, um, it was never an issue of, oh my God, I'm really craving this, especially when it came to non-vegan. Um, I think I've mentioned in videos before that like vegan was just, um, vegan hit, hit immediately the very first weekend that I started uh, getting any information about the raw vegan lifestyle and you know it just uh, it made sense and it just I don't know something happened something happened and that aha moment happened that light bulb went off and it just made sense and it's made sense ever since and it, it, you know it's a process it's a process of continually learning more making some adjustments or whatever but for me, anyway, it's not about making these bits, it's about tweaking, my favorite word, it's about tweaking. It's not about, um, you know, jumping from one thing to the next. I've found what I'm looking for, I'm pretty sure. I may not have found the exact final version and, it, the, you know, there's going to be changes along the way and ways to do it, but I, I had my aha moment. It made sense. Um, now what is the purpose of this video? Because I can't give you an aha moment and you can only have that aha moment um, when you're ready for it, I guess. But I don't know, just maybe know that if you are really, really struggling and you're falling off and you're, uh, you're not happy about your progress on, your, on the way you eat or on your fitness, your health, whatever, um, maybe you just haven't had that aha moment yet where it all just makes sense and it's just like, well, this is just, listen, there's no, I don't have any choice other than to do this. It's like, you know, if, I, if there's a bottle over here with something in it, a liquid in it, and you drink it and it's poison, well, no harm, no foul. You didn't do something, you know, you didn't know. But once somebody has told you, once I tell you that's poison in that bottle over there, you're going to die if you drink it. Well, if you drink it after, I mean, only, okay, I'm taking it to an exaggeration with the food there, but only an idiot would you, if I told you there's poison in there, it's going to kill you, you wouldn't think about drinking it. 
that's kind of what happened to me with the food. It just kind of had gotten to it's gotten to a point where, or it, it, it I was ready. I was ready. That's all I can say. I was ready, and I it made sense to me, and I didn't want to live how I was living anymore, and I gave it a shot. Now, obviously, if I had not felt something, you know, I had to have some results after I came to this conclusion. But as I felt better and better and better and better, and I learned more and I was making less mistakes and I was learning to get everything in that I needed, then it just, uh, you know, it was even easier still. But yeah, so anyhow, like I say, just thought I'd share that with you because uh, you gotta, you gotta really, it's gotta be part of your essence. It can't just be a diet. If it's a diet like the Atkins diet, the South Beach diet, Weight Watchers, the Mediterranean diet, um, the Ding Dong diet, the uh, eat all the cheese you want diet. If it's just another diet, it's going to be another phase you're going to pass through, and you might as well go ahead and go on Google and start looking for the next thing. Anyhow, hope your week's off to a good start. Um, hope you are, uh, let me show you around a little bit more. Let's do, a, let's do a swing around. This is a nice little park here. This is the jungle gym obviously it's during school kids aren't out here but um yeah the only thing i don't like is they've started making these things out of wood there used to be a lot of metal so they were better as a as a gym but you know these kids these kids are soft today we fell we cut ourselves we didn't wear helmets and we lived anyhow i hope you guys enjoyed this one peace